of course, I'm in no position to answer that because that will be depending on the on, on whether MSCC decides to open the investigation again and uh, and what is the result of the investigation as well as at the end it will be the AG chambers that will decide whether charges will be brought onto them. And uh, as I said, for me, what is important to me is uh, with all the anti-corruption measures that the federal government, the Pakatan Harapan, Pakatan Harapan government has taken so far, uh, I urge that such efforts be expanded to the shores of Sarawak because in Sarawak, uh, when we talk about fighting corruption, there is a white elephant in the room that we really need to address, and uh, which is uh, all the different allegations towards our current governor and our previous chief minister. So there were multiple investigations open up against him with the recent one, uh, the recent allegations by of course, Sarawak report saying that he has a hand in uh, some, some oil deal with Petros, Petros and Oman. So whether those allegations are true, um, I leave it to authorities to, to investigate and uh, it does warrant for the investigation on the matter. But I like to stress that uh, it, it is not a witch hunt. At the end, uh, we are not just after one person, but uh, it is important for us to send a message. It's important for us to set a principle that uh, corruption and uh, abuse of power is should not and shall not be tolerated, regardless of position, wealth, or power. Once you amend the federal constitution to add like a, like the federal nature consists of states in West Malaysia and B, Sabah and Sarawak. That itself will give, as I said, uh, territorial integrity towards uh, Sabah and Sarawak as equal partners. So I believe we shall be known as equal partners or the territory of Sabah and Sarawak. And that, for me, that is uh, a good representation of our status in the Federation of Malaysia. I think it has to be looked in context. Uh, I believe uh, while recognition is important, context of uh, our other rights is also important. So as I said, uh, it's the responsibility of the Special Cabinet Committee to study it and to propose the required, uh, required proposals and, and, and cadangan and proposals to, for the Cabinet to consider the mm -hmm. limit. Mm -hmm. I personally as a backbencher, and, I, and I'm not sure whether I'll be part of the committee yet, but then no matter what, I'll follow up and to make sure that it will be given, what is rightfully ours will be given to us. We are not demanding for anything extra, we are not demanding for anything that is, we are not demanding for the skies or the moons or the stars, just what was agreed in the beginning of the Federation, during the formation of the Federation of Malaysia.